the I'm all, this is Mr. J's Van Crump, Javon Van Crump, how are that guy, Mr. J's Van Crump. Um, hood, man, hustling over obstacles daily, making all dollars equal. It's the crew, it's the brand, it's the label, it's the uh, clothing line. Um, I do what I do basically for the love of it. Um, and it provides me a way to touch people, to reach people in ways that other people can't. I mean, if you come from a neighborhood or a city or any place that's less than, uh, less than you know, glorifying, then uh, you have a hard time trying to, you know, get your way in through the cracks and uh, reach certain individuals. Um, for me, music allows me to reach those individuals. It allows me to get inside their mind, allow me to get inside their life and uh, provide some sort, of, uh, some sort of spark of uh, motivation for them. Uh, let them know that there is a way. Hood made, hustling over obstacles daily, making all dollars equal. It's an, acronym, it's an acronym for the way of life. And you know, if you hustle over obstacles daily to make all your dollars equal, you hood made, like it or not. And I'm here to bring that reality to you. I'm elevated, mind elevated, looking down on the greatest Colorado 14ers. What it do, what it does, what it is, what it is. In regards to anything else in the entertainment that we'd like to do or that I'd like to do, um, most of the stuff I'm already doing and uh, the stuff that I ain't already doing, we already have a start on. Um, it's more than music. Who have made us more than music? Like I said, it's a lifestyle. Um, so you got the clothing line, Hood May University. Um, we, me and my brother and I, my brother and I, uh, Keelan Young, know, uh, we're both working on um, books of our own. I have an album coming out called The First Book of Crump. And then I'm writing a book called The First Book of Crump, the actual book. Um, my brother, Keelan, he has a, a book that he's working on as well. And then we're also trying to do some on-screen stuff, doing uh, small little movies, um, you know, independent films, uh, short films, anywhere from uh, 20 minutes long to an hour long. Um, we're actually trying to get into uh, doing the promotional thing again, where we're not just promoting ourselves, but we're promoting other artists around the country that's uh, local or regional. And, uh, you know, it's a big business, man. We're trying to trying to open up the umbrella and bring every asset, uh, you know, every uh, part of the business and entertainment world to you. Rather than you wearing it, listening to it, uh, seeing it, trying to have our hands in it. In regards to uh, a little history on who I made. Um, Man, where do I begin? I guess I began in 1997. It's been hood-made since 97. It's on the brand, it's on the label, it's on the logo, it's on every piece of clothing that we support. Um, we first started off with the music. My CD was uh, in an EP called um, All He Wanted. And then I had a follow-up to that called The Lost Pages. Uh, under hood-made as a label, We've uh, released, I would say, over 10 CDs underground, hand-to-hand, uh, -hand in the streets. Uh, some mom-and-pop stores might have hooked us up, showed a little love, and sold them into their places. Um, but since 90, 1997, we had um, uh, All They Wanted EP, um, The Lost Pages. We had the Seldom Seen, Often Heard uh, compilation, uh, volumes one and two. Uh, we had the Lost Pages unedited. Um, we had a um, couple of couple of groups under our uh, under our wing, the Underdogs. Um, you know, we we got a, a a whole crew of producers. I want to give a shout out to the producers on the hood on the hood made uh, B Squad. We got Lek One. That's L E C K O N E from Omaha, Nebraska. Lek One. Up in Virginia, rapping. He been rapping the Big Red up in Virginia for over ten years now, doing the thing, holding me down. If you like that sound, you like that hood made sound, you like some of the tracks that I'm on. Nine times out of ten, it's like one. 
That's the best producer I know of. The best uh, uh, known unknown that's around here right now. Uh, Papadopoulos in Lake Charles, Louisiana. Kim Folk of mine, Papadopoulos Band Crump. Makes a lot of the tracks for us as well. And then I got a whole host of other producers around the United States, and I do mean around the United States, that just send your boy some tracks every now and then and say, hey, when I made this, I was thinking of you. Um, outside of the music, we did move to the clothes. Outside of the clothes, we did move to promotion. Um, outside of promoting just regular artists, uh, rap artists, we started promoting R&B. Then we started promoting uh, comedians. Then we started promoting a whole bunch of different clubs in general, just promoting the venues alone. Um, so with music, with clothes, and with promotions, uh, that's basically what Hood Made has been riding on over the years, the past uh, 13, 14 years, I'm proud to say. Um, we also uh, want to give a, a shout out, a hood, big Hood Made shout out to Boulder Hustle Holly. Uh, that's, you know, I mean, this man has single-handedly kept Omaha alive uh, through his own hard work ethic. And uh, Hood made an exclusive sounds, Ben Crumb, Boulder Hustle, Holly. We've been doing something together for forever, it seems like. But I can honestly say right now that even the buzz that I created out of state really ain't nothing compared to the buzz that Boulder Hustle, Holly then kept for Hood made as a business and as a, um, a music company. Go to us all the he hood made for show, that's my nigga. Impossible is if the chunk of cake of cream. None can't see me. And it ain't gonna be easy. Colorado loser and I'm a hundred bags Okay. Three ways that the city can support me without spending money. I'll start with uh spreading the music. Okay? You gotta get the music. You just gotta get the music. That's how you start. That's the first uh, part of the way. Because you get the music. You can get the music from me. You can get the music from anybody who listens to Hood Made. You can go online. You can Google us. You can Facebook us. You can MySpace us. You can YouTube us. You can go to ReverbNation.com slash J Van Crump. All of those places. ThatPiff.com. Put in the petition. You can get all of the Hood Made music from anywhere. You just got to know where to get it. And once you do acquire that music, once you do get that hood made sound, spread it. Give it to people. Listen to it while you're riding down the street in your car. You're going to pick somebody up and they get in the car. Who is that? Well, that's Crump. That's hood made. Listen to it. Spread it. That's number one. You can spread the music without even spending a whole bunch of money. I don't care if you burn the, burn the CD. I ain't got Jay-Z money. I want it. But shit. You know. He had to give his music away before he got a million. I'll give mine away. I got plenty of songs, over 500 in the catalog. Uh, two, I'll say, um, go ahead and come to the shows. Come to the shows. Be, be active in participating with the shows. Now, you ain't got to spend no money if you do it right. I mean, we're always giving away free tickets on the radio. We're always giving away free tickets at certain clubs. We, you might see us in the streets and we'd be like, hey, what's happening? We're doing a show. You want to come? I got some freebies right now. Holla at your boy. Come up and talk to us. Interact with us. We're just trying to make some money. We're just trying to make some music. We ain't bigger than nobody. We ain't better than nobody. So you can still come through and holla at us, walk up to us and shake our hand. A handshake could get you and the homies in for free. So come to the shows and support it. That's what it do. And um, number three, how you can support me without spending no money? Wear my shit. Wear hood made. If you wear a hood made, whether you got a t-shirt, a sweatshirt, a whole jumpsuit, or what have you, if you got some of that, wear it. Just somebody gonna ask where you get it from. Somebody gonna ask what does it mean. Somebody gonna ask who made it. And promotion is key. It's all word of mouth. You say, well, I might have to spend some money to get that shirt. Maybe not. It's the same way with the tickets. You see some, you see us selling them. You go up, hey, I really want one. I tell you what, if you come to me and you're like, hey, uh, I really dig that shirt. I want it. I only got a dollar, and I'm saving that for the bus. But I might, you know, I, I really want it. I might just have to holler at you later. If I see that you really want it, here, yeah, take it. Because you really want it. 
now that you got it, wear it. Somebody gonna have something that's good enough for me. Good night. Okay, when I leave L402, two steps, and I'm gonna make to, uh, and I'm gonna take to further my movement. The internet game is real hot right now. And they, if you, you out there and you listening, you watching, step your internet game up. You gotta do it, man. I was one of them cats like, man, fuck the internet, man. I, you know, I ain't about to spend all that time on there. I ain't even like Facebook. I thought it was a bunch of bogus bullshit, man. Just, you know, people getting on there and not have nothing to do. Again, Bo the Hustleholic, my dude, he stepped that internet game up. He took advantage of Facebook. He started throwing shows. He can start buying less flyers. You know what I'm saying? Like, damn. He got a whole bunch of people at his shows. Now... You step your internet game up, take advantage of all those free sites. I remember back in the day, you used to have to pay to get your website built and then pay a monthly domain fee just to have your own website up. Well, that's all cool, fine and dandy if you're corporate. But if not, you might as well take advantage of these free websites where people can find you. And you got to do all your promotion on all of them. Promote everything you can. They can put up pictures, they can put up music, and do all that stuff. You know this, I ain't telling you nothing new. Other than the fact that you need to step the game up and get everything out there. Because some people ain't got nothing to do. Some people ain't got cable, but they got the damn internet. You know what I mean? So you make sure that you on the internet, step your game up. When I leave here, I'm jumping on the Facebook, on the MySpace, on the, all that Reverb Nation. Um, getting on there, man, I'm update, I'm going to send out all the widgets, use all the tools that they provide you with, and um, I'm going to send it out there, man, whether I'm promoting a, a party, a club, the clothes, the music, myself, yeah, I'm, that's, what I'm, that's one of the steps I'm going to take when I get out of here, which I'm already on, but it's become like a daily thing. Get on the internet at least once, maybe spend an hour or so on there, at minimum, and uh, move around. Move around. Because when you're promoting your own stuff, you could actually run across something else that you like. Oh, man, I got to get a part of this. Oh, I know him. I ain't seen him in a long time. He doing that. I need to be on that then. And you can open up your eyes to a whole bunch of shit. We in the future now, ain't we? 2011. We in the future, man. You need to take care of that. Step number two, just, you know, I mean, I'm, I'm, I don't talk too much. I do on camera, but I don't. Get out there and use that mouthpiece, man. Because whatever you ain't typing in on the internet and looking at on the screen, you can say with your own voice. It ain't how long you talk. It's what you put in it. So when I leave here, I'm going to get my internet game up, and I might pick up the horn, get on the phone, and start making some business calls. But you got to keep it going, man. Closed mouths don't get fed. And I'm hungry. I did. Well,